we are live right now um let's check this out it's a police chase with someone on a motorbike um and this dude is going high speeds you know he's all out with it Let, but let's check it out hold it for here perfect Wow. Look at that. Climb if you can and go south. Crazy. Crazy. He's trying to escape with a motorbike. I mean, he ain't going to get too far. Mm -mm. Interesting. You know how dangerous those things are, motorbike? Man, you hit a bump. Oh, man. All right, George. We got it. Where you went? Where'd he go? That's crazy. There he is. Right there. Right next to that white truck. Where is he? Oh, oh. There he is. Go, go this direction and just give me a left pedal turn. Turn it put it into a hover. I see him. It's crazy see how they right could here? film this from the helicopter. Perfect. Well, motorbikes are fast too. So we'll see how it ends. You know, I, I highly, highly doubt Hold it that right he'll here. get away or something bad yeah, don't happen. Forward. You know, push your nose over. I saw him. Let's go left a little bit. There's nobody out there. Come left for me. Oh, yeah, we'll boy, he would have smashed into that. Is that it? He okay. would have smashed into Stop that over here. Dang. That puss. I would climb if you can. Just get a little higher. Okay, hold it right here. Just give me a left. Give me a hold it right here for a moment and climb. Go right up to this cloud layer. You're oh, doing a great no. job, by the way. I'll get right behind you. Okay, let's go straight ahead. <clears throat> He turned around. Right here. Now he went back that way. So <laughs> just uh, pull it into a hover, make a right pedal turn. This is good. Go to the north a little bit. Just hold it right here, basically. You're good. Just hold it in a hover. Oh, that's uh, crazy. You better go to north this. so we're not right on top of the sheriff ship. Get, keep going north. You're clear out my window. Good job. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he did. You know, we've gone around in circles to just south of the two town on the lake in Colorado here on Green Street now, uh, right in the heart of downtown Pasadena. Um, it's unclear Pasadena PD is going to get involved. There we go. We talked about this earlier. Went into a parking structure, and that's why you want to have units behind him if you want to take him into custody because uh, we're into a parking structure here with a helicopter overhead. Uh, he'll be radioing for the patrol units in Pasadena to head this direction. And we, uh -oh. all we can do is keep a He's wide shot and see if we see the suspect come out. But I've seen several of these pursuits with motorcycles and, and vehicles as well, where the suspect will finally go into a parking structure and then try and make a run for it on foot. And we'll just have to see exactly is how this him? is going to unfold. No. There's one. I thought that this was a motorbike over here. Yep. Right there. Two. Oh, that's this. A it's possible. I mean, he may have got out, and we didn't see him. Uh, nor did the uh, sheriff's helicopter overhead. It, it, it's hard to say, but they're going to surround this parking structure now, and that's the trade-off that you have. If you're going to follow a suspect on a motorcycle, uh, driving erratically at those rates of speed with patrol cars, you risk the officers and you risk the public. Uh, but if you had them behind the motorcycle when he pulls into a parking structure, more than likely you could surround it quickly and take that individual into custody. So, in my opinion, I think it's better to just let him go, especially, oh, yeah, you know, we yeah, just heard that it's basically, at this well. point, just guilty of a misdemeanor um, 
you know, if it was a big truck traveling at those rates of speeds, then I think they'd have to do something to make sure they were uh, going to try and stop it. But at this point, if the suspect goes into this parking structure and makes a run for it, nobody gets hurt, then this uh, ends pretty well. It'll end uh, very well if they get him into custody just to make sure he doesn't do something silly like this again. I mean, he might go out the other end, though, at the same time. He really, you know, you never know. I'm sure they got all, all the uh, exits blocked, though, at this point, you know. Go to the right. I wonder if that was one of them fast motorbikes, you know. I'm not. Yeah, you know, Pasadena PD, this is their, their area. They'll be fair, uh, very familiar with the surroundings. You may not be able to get out on that side, Philip. So if you ride in, you may have to come back on to um, Green Street. I'm not certain about that, but I do know that, you know, the patrol cars who patrol this area are very familiar with it. They know the ingress and egress of these parking structures. That's what they do. Every day they're out on their patrol. They check these areas. So they're going to know if there's another way out. If there's not then if he can't ride out, then basically he's only able to walk out. So they do want to surround it uh, at this point. And we didn't see him come back out from the parking structure. So we still believe that he's inside and the sheriff's helicopter is overhead just orbiting. Uh, it looks like they believe that he's inside. They did not see him come out either. It looks like we're hearing That's they're crazy. arresting somebody. Push in to the left on the street there. I believe they might be arresting someone. We did hear that. Um, we're going to try and drift a little bit so we can get into the front, but they may have just taken the suspect into custody. Where is that? Oh. Wow. They got the is, dude on the bike. That's someone. I'm not certain if it's oh. him or not. Oh, it might not be the dude It could be if he got bike. rid of his um, sweater. Oh, he might have got rid of his sweater. You heard the dude? That makes sense. Man, that is freaking crazy. Dude on a motorbike. Oh, man. All right. No telling what happened there. No telling what happened. Why don't you climb a little bit if you can? I think we can go up a little another 50, 100 feet. Man, there you go. Wow. So they ended up catching him. Wow, at first I didn't think they would, but <laughs> I mean, yep, they got him. Wow, that is something, boy. Who would have thought? Who would have thought that would have happened? I mean, you know, it's very dangerous already just to drive a motorbike. Uh, but to try to go really fast on the high on the highway to uh get get away is is even crazier, you know. Uh, you risk a lot of dangers, you know, like I mean, like of you know dangers that would happen to you by riding on a motorbike. You don't have no seatbelt, you know. Uh, but yeah. I mean, that is just crazy that he did that. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. And if y'all did, leave a like and comment. And subscribe to my channel for more content like this. And thanks for watching.